and um, I just conquered one of my post Elijah demons or hurdles. I don't know what you refer to them as, but for me, they're the things that I am dreading doing, especially for the first time post losing Elijah. And one of the things I was completely dreading was returning to this restaurant right here. Um, it's Baker Square. I don't know if you have them in Ottawa. <laughs> they have really good pie. Um, I was here a million times when I was pregnant with Elijah. I was teaching a class, and so a lot of my class prep work I did here at Baker Square. And so I, uh, I know all the employees, not all. There were three employees that were always here when I was here working and so they knew all about the class I was teaching, they knew that I was expecting Elijah in July, they knew uh, my basics of my life story and so they were all excited about Elijah coming and uh, but of course then once my class was done in May I didn't come back here because I didn't have work I needed to get done. So I just I didn't come back and I just have dreaded coming back here since because I knew the employees I would see them and they would ask oh how are you doing how's your baby and then you have to tell them that he died and then they feel bad and then you have to comfort them and then blah 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 it's the conversation you dread so it's not the fault obviously they that's sweet that they know and that they care and they wanted to know about um, about Elijah but then you have to tell people you don't really know very well about your baby dying and it's, it's not fun. So this is my first time back. It's eight and a half months now since Elijah died and this was the first time I could kind of bear the thought of coming back and sort of conquering this demon. So anyway, but once it's done, then the employees know that he died and then now we can come back here again and get the world's best pie. So <laughs> that's something, right? Talk to you later, Becca.